I'm Rafi Limon, OM Tech Laser Support Specialist. The door sensor is a critical safety feature for any CO2 laser engraver. It prevents the laser from firing while the door is open, protecting you from harmful laser beam reflections. When your door sensor doesn't work properly, you may not be able to fire the laser, or it can fire with the cover door open, making an unsafe situation. Today, I'll show you how to replace the door sensor on your OM Tech. To replace the door sensor, you'll need the triangle key, an adjustable wrench, and depending on your machine model, you might need a small flathead screwdriver and a Phillips head screwdriver. Once you have all your tools ready, we can move on to the first step. Step one, open the work bed cover door and locate the door sensor. Depending on your machine, there may be one on the right side of the door jam or two sensors, one on each side. Step two, open the access panel nearest the door sensor and locate the back side of the sensor. Loosen both of the retaining nuts and remove them. Then slide the sensor out of the mount. Step three, trace the door sensor cable through the cable slot and find where it connects, either to the main board or a relay near the main board. Unplug the sensor cable from the main board or relay and remove the cable from the machine. Make a mental note of the plug's location and take extra care to keep the other cables in order. Step four, now we can install the new door sensor. First, plug the new door sensor into the main board or relay where you unplug the old one. Step five, carefully feed the door sensor back through the same wire slot as before and be mindful to manage your cables. Step six, place one of the nuts on the door sensor and screw it about halfway on. Slide the door sensor through the mounting bracket and then screw on the other nut to mount it in place. Step seven, turn on the machine and water cooling system. Then open the cover door. Put on the laser safety glasses, move towards the back of the machine and press the pulse button. There should be an error code that says machine protected work paused. Then close the door cover and press the pulse again. The laser should fire this time, indicating that your new door sensor is working properly. If it's not working for you, give us a call and I'll be happy to help. And that's how to replace your door sensor. If you have any questions, let us know in the comments and be sure to subscribe to OMTech on YouTube. That's all for now. Thanks for watching this OMTech install.